Hello guys, welcome back to another scratch tutorial on how to make a Super Mario Runner game. So, in today's video, we'll make a jump and a scrolling ground. So, let's make it. Okay, so let's get started. So, so far we've got the home screen being implemented. We've got the music and press space to play. We don't have anything, okay? So uh, let's make the Mario jumping on the ground. So in the Mario, right, we're gonna put in a when I receive reset. We'll simply hide it. And when I receive play, we will show it. Go to X, like negative 200, Y0. And then we'll make two new variables one is x velocity for this way only and y velocity for this way only we'll set both to zero at the very beginning and we'll put in a forever loop we'll switch costume to hitbox and then we'll make a new block named platformer run without screen refresh okay make another block naming it animate run without screen refresh then put both of these there animate the platformer here so in the define platformer you will change y velocity by negative 1.5 and then we will change y by y velocity and then if touching ground we will like Repeat until not touching ground. We'll change y by 1 and then we'll set y velocity to 0. And then if a bunch of ores, key space pressed or key up arrow pressed or key w pressed or mouse down okay then we'll set y velocity to 18 like that and uh, now if we show the ground that and just like that we got some cool platformer like only jumping that's cool okay okay so now in here you will put in a change x by three and then if the x position is more than zero then we'll simply set x to zero okay so when we play and then the mario sprite goes there it's now a hitbox okay so uh now let's animate player not just a square like this so okay so it to do this we'll make a new variable naming it touching ground for the sprite only and then right here we'll set touching ground to zero and then in here we'll set touching ground to one 
And then at the very beginning, we'll set touching ground to zero too. So, if else block, touching ground equals zero, then we will wait. Yeah, then we will switch costume to. Oh, we'll switch costume to law of mod times okay so floor of timer times 10 we'll mod that by i will run animation so one two three okay so mod that by three that and then right here else we'll switch costume to jump like that so if we were to test this our oh um wait if it actually i messed up in this part so uh we just need to switch that and now if we test this oh, that works but if i forgot to add in a plus by three at the beginning, so three plus full of timer. Let's test that. This and now we got our run animation and our jump animation working. Cool. So now let's make the ground sliding or maybe scrolling. So in here we'll put it when i receive reset simply hide it and when i receive play you will delete all of the clones so delete this clone and then when i receive play we'll go to our x position and y position x0 y negative 70 and we will or show it and we'll create a clone right above the go to x so and um, forever we will make a block named scroll run without screen refresh right there and define scroll right here and then we'll put in a oh, when i start as a clone we will duplicate this and we'll put this go to x 480 and then define scroll we'll set size to 400 then we'll change x by negative 5 for now and then if the x position is less than negative 480 then we will set x to 480 and then we'll set size to 100 so let's test that and now you can see we have a scrolling ground so thank you for watching please leave a like comment share and consider subscribing and i'll see you in the next part bye